Hi, I'm Catherine Pugh. I'm environmental scientist at the city of Launceston and today I have my ecology hat on. We're down at the West Tamar Swamp Forests between the highway and the Tamar beside us here and we have a little burrowing crayfish in my hands here. Burrowing crayfish are found all over Australia. There are 35 species in Australia and 15 of those are found in Tassie. What's interesting is that of the 15 in Tasmania, 13 are found nowhere else. They're endemic species, they're only found in Tasmania. We don't know which species this little guy is. Not a lot is known about the burrowing crayfish in Launceston. We know that we have their chimneys popping up in our remnant swamp forests around the place. But unless you see them out on the ground like this, then you can't tell which species they are. This little guy was found by Conservation Volunteers Australia who are down here doing some track works and weed removal. It's really important work and we're really grateful to the Conservation Volunteers for doing that work. This guy's got one claw that's quite a bit bigger than the other one and that's probably because it's lost one claw in a fight or through injury and it's growing a new claw back. But eventually it will have two nice big claws the same size. These guys live in swamp forests. Wetlands and salt marshes and swamps are really important habitat for these guys and that's one of the reason why five of the 15 species in Tasmania are on the threatened species list. We have drained a lot of our wetlands um, and cleared a lot of our swamp forests and so we tend to find them in quite limited distribution that there's not a lot of habitat left for them. So it's pretty exciting to have found one here. We don't, didn't have any records on our maps before that these guys occur in here. Having them here is a great sign that this swamp forest is doing okay. The other thing that's great about this swamp forest is threatened vegetation but it also contains a lot of threatened plant species. So it's a really valuable patch and it's a, a testament to Launceston that we've got it here in this, this beautiful little remnant that we can all enjoy. We don't usually get to see burrowing crayfish out on the surface like this. Mostly we only know that they're around because they leave their telltale chimneys sticking up out of the mud. They leave their chimneys there, they're breathing holes for their burrows and their burrows can be really quite deep, several metres in places. They dig down to get to the water table because they're, you know, they're a crayfish so they need to be in the water. That's why when we take water away from our swamps and our wetlands, that's how it affects these guys. They need that water table there. He or she is certainly at the other end of the scale of Lobby, the giant freshwater crayfish that we had here in Launceston a few weeks ago for Resilient Cities, over, held over at the museum, um, but equally as impressive and a beautiful specimen. So we're going to uh, consult with some crayfish experts and try and find out exactly which species this is, which will be a great new record for Launceston. Mm -hmm.